Have you ever imagined being sold by the people you love the most to work for the people who love you the least? Having to work for a whole day in a hazardous carpeting factory filled with dusty and dirty air. Hundreds of children from different parts of India are gathered in this tiny factory moving their tiny and delicate hands to weave the perfect carpet that their master would approve. Young, frail children in dusty and musty workplaces are forced to work continually like slaves for long periods of time. With over 45 million children in forced child labor, India is home to one-fourth of the world's child workers. Poverty is one of the main causes of child labor. About 11.2 million children under the age of 14 are forced by their parents to work in factories because of the extreme poverty. Parents are unable to support the whole family with their own abilities and therefore they push their children to seek a job and work for extra income which is used for the family's survival. Another cause of child labor is the acceptance of it. The child workers that work while growing up might allow their children to work based on their own experience. The older children understand that education is a basic and extremely important tool to break the cycle of poverty and child labor. The acceptance of child labor causes it to continue by letting the children work instead of getting educated. This is a problem because it is blocking children's futures. They are unable to get an education and just keep working and working. This cycle keeps continuing over and over again because their parents don't educate children and not allow them to go to school. There are several solutions for child labor, including more strict laws, education, and eliminating poverty. Even though there is a law in India banning children under the age of 14 from working, the law is not well enforced. If the Indian authorities are more serious about protecting children from hazardous labor, the state government should start prosecuting abusive employers and rehabilitating child workers. Another solution to decrease child labor is to enforce education. The parents of the child laborers are uneducated so they do not realize how important education is for their children. The work, work time work should belong to growing up, not to childhood. Children are in danger. We should listen to them before it is too late to stop. Children all over the world need to grow up secure and protected under proper orders. They are our future. Giving hopes and dreams to growing youngsters is an important duty for our entire society. Who knows, child workers may become influential people throughout the world and contribute for India's development in many ways. Showing a little concern and interest in trying to solve this issue of child labor could bring children a lot of happiness and a bright new future. A little nicer up here